Hey people, so I'm back with a yam pepper soup recipe and the idea of this is really to show you how you can use up your leftover yam. So with my leftover yam, I tend to chop them up um, and then freeze them. So when I'm ready to cook them, I just bring water to a boil and I throw in my frozen yam straight in, um, cover the pot and give it about 10 to 15 minutes to soften. And then I go on with the other elements, so the pepper soup elements. But for this, I like to use um, hot chicken because it has um, a lot more depth to its flavor. So I season this with some salt, a uh, stock cube. I grind three scotch bonnet chilies, but you could use more with the idea of pepper soup. Uh, and then I like to uh, chop one large onion into four big chunks just to get their flavors in. Eventually I get rid of the onions themselves. Then I also top up with some more water to cover the level of the, ch of the chicken because this juice is what's gonna be the background for your yam, really. So yeah, be fairly generous with your water um, as long as you balance the other flavors as well. So once it starts to simmer, I add my scent leaves. But if you don't have this, you could use basil. This adds a different dimension of flavor as well. I also add a teaspoon of black peppercorns, again for their flavor. Um, and then cover the pots again and just let it boil until your chicken has softened. You kind of know your chicken is getting ready when your onions have changed color a lot. A lot of oil has come afloat. You could also taste the chicken to be sure that it has softened. And then for the yam, you want to poke holes through it with a fork. And once they're going through fairly easily, you know your yam is ready to eat. So then I go on and I serve. This you can have at any time of the year, but you have a higher appreciation for this in winter. Thanks for watching and enjoy.